before you proceed to unzip folder, you need to make sure that you install all the dependencies eh? then into the machine first. Like this one here, I've been downloaded here eh? to show you how to continue from here. Eh? In general, be away because um, from the canvas, right? Usually you will install in the virtual machine but inside got some exploit offensive uh, files. Eh? In the normal AT wireless uh, scenario, it will basically will be attacked to block or being identified them is the hostile file. So you might make sure that to making the uh, disable why this um, it depend on your company policy. Anyway, so this one we continue to proceed uh, to be performed for the installation. First, now you can see here is the screen for the we are starting to do for the installation for all the dependencies. Eh? So just install. So in this way, it will be complete already. So we just end it up. So that you're getting from the principal side, then unzip it so that you can be putting into where you want to uh, make the installation. So unzip it first. Depend on your preference for the installation directory. Like me, after the unzip, basically I will move it into the root, then create the canvas slash install because it will be the shortest that I can get. Uh. Then, then it will be easier for the execute a lot of command that way as well. I will move it also. Uh, usually, I will. Depend on your, uh, your main hub if you need to follow. Uh, what I did, I will fall in into the, the nearest to the roof. Uh, it's basically came here as well. It's a really classic. It will point this because of the, the hostile file, the wireless potential is this. Eh? So, what we need to do is to be disable. Real time protection of okay. Now the file is inside. This is the shortest uh, I can get. I right? just do stretch canvas. Uh, it's more easier for run uh, the command than any from here. But of course, they depend on some people. Uh, some people short, some people long. Eh? PSY, crypto, B crap, MACI. Right? Step 6. Because this all the step is being done. Uh, so we just need to go to the step 6 for uh, additionally thing that it cannot be uh, step 6, right? Yeah, the thing that is missing is here. So what we need to do is go to the uh, item eh? seven, then issue the command. Okay, it's done. Then we can uh, continue to issue the second command. Eh? To getting all those the rest of uh, dependency due to the licensing uh, principle cannot be uh, compounded together, right? So uh, we continue. And the draw IP is the optional pack, lah. Uh, so. Uh, you install or not install for me, um, I no need it, so I will be skip this uh, installation. And uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, but it still mentioned I have a 3 things not installed, right? 
complete one eh? besides even using the M pipe because of the they have uh, one item called pipe Python crypto right you need this specific installer the Windows C++ compiler for Python 2.7 eh? so go to download it then you can continue to run these three uh, command in one go lah, eh? basically the thing just now starting on here then the next two is being also powered as well so actually the rest of two you will run directly right eh? you don't have issue one so the thing is a thing that uh, if you want to run this uh, crypto dependency you need to have installer after you have all those things installed already right so you will have no issue to to running the canvas when you have those things of course after you have the uh, accept the licensing then it will run one uh, so it will be something like the screen you see so that's it so the uh, installer successfully boot up send the rest of thing is uh, for you to use it uh, right for your use case uh, uh. okay thank you everyone